Hey, Robin and Frazier. Just wanted to give y'all a little hello since we can't be there with you. We are all so heartbroken that we can't be there in person. So Sarah just had a really great idea to send y'all a little video just to make sure you know that we're thinking of you and celebrating with you just from a few miles away. Um, Robin, you are such an incredible person. I was lucky enough to be your roommate for so many years, um, but also just your friend. You are so sweet and kind and gentle and strong and hilarious and really one of the most genuine people that I've ever met in my life. Um, I've never known somebody to put people before yourself like you do and it's an honor to call you my friend, to call you one of my best friends. Um, I know that if I ever needed anything that I could call you and you would be there in two seconds. Um, and that really is an incredible thing. And Frazier, when I first met you, of course I was a little nervous because, you know, got to be a little protective. But the minute I saw y'all together, the minute I saw how happy you made Robin and how happy she makes you, I knew everything was going to be so good between y'all. It's really incredible to watch you two together, hear you talk about one another, just love on each other. Um, it's really incredible that y'all have found each other and met such a great match, found such a great match within each other. Um, I love you both. I can't wait to see what the future brings for y'all. I know it's going to be so much fun, full of so much laughter, um, and just so much love. And, you know, we feel that with Robin and Frazier. We can't wait to feel that same love with you. But, um, again, we are so excited for the two of you and so sad that we can't be there for you, but... Love you guys. Congratulations again. Robin, you're getting married. And I hate that I can't be there to celebrate with you. I just want to hug you so tight and kiss you and love on you. Because I'm sending you so much love here from California over to you in Thailand. And today and every day. But especially today. And just wanted you to know that I'm cheering for you and Fraser from here. And I love you both so much. Um, you are honestly one of the most kind and humble and genuine people that I've ever met. Ever. 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 Um, and then when I've gotten to meet and get to know Fraser, he's probably the second kindest and most genuine people that I've ever met. Ever. Um, and you guys are just such a great match. I remember when you were moving out to London and you were telling me about how he was building you a closet out of the second bedroom and getting all crafty and cute and I thought, this guy really gets Robin, and also he's so kind and caring, and as I've gotten to know him, he really is. Um, you guys truly deserve each other, and so much happiness. Um, so, loving you both, and I hope you have a great wedding, and an awesome honeymoon, and life together. I hope to celebrate with you soon in person, and just know I'm sending you lots of love until then. Go Team Robin Frazier! Woo! Hi Robin and Frazier. So sorry that I couldn't make it to the wedding, but I'm so happy that Sarah had this idea to send you videos from all of us congratulating you because we're all just so very happy for you. Um, I'm so sad we can't be there, but cheers from San Francisco um, and congratulations on your wedding. Um, so I know I've never met Fraser before, but um, anytime he comes up in uh, conversation or anytime it comes up that I've never met him before, everybody, no matter who I'm talking to, always says the same thing, which is that he's so perfect for Robin. And hearing that over and over again um, just really warms my heart. Um, Robin's been such an amazing friend and such an amazing person to so many people um, in her life that she really deserves this and I'm just so happy for you too. And I just wanted to say thank you to Frazier for making her so happy and thank you for being that perfect person for her. Um, ever since I've met Robin, 
Um, she's always been just one of the most loving and caring, selfless people that I've ever met in my life. Um, anytime I think about her, I just think about how big of a heart she has. Um, she's always put other people first, um, kind of who she is. Just like at her bachelorette party when she got really thoughtful, personalized gifts for everyone. Um, that's just a perfect example of how she is and how she um, handles her relationships and her um, the people in her life. She's just naturally so um, caring and always puts other people first. Um, so I'm really happy that you guys found each other because it sounds like um, you're such a good match. Um, and I know this is um, not exactly on topic, on the wedding topic, but I just wanted to tell Robin um, that I'm so proud of you for everything that you've accomplished, um, being with you in college and seeing how hard you've worked, how hard you worked in school, and how you set your mind to your goals and how you've reached those goals um, has been super, super inspirational to me. Um, I'm really blown away by all of your accomplishments and um, I'm so happy for you and how far you've come. Um, I know it hasn't always been easy for you and um, you've been super strong and resilient and um, worked your butt off and yeah, I'm just, you're like, I'm just so proud of you and happy for you. Um, you guys deserve all of this happiness. You deserve to have an amazing wedding. Um, Again, I wish that I could be there. I've already seen some of the pictures. It looks amazing. Um, but yeah, take lots of pictures and have so much fun. All right, cheers from San Francisco and congratulations. Love you. Bobby Frazier, it's your wedding or it's your wedding tomorrow or it's your wedding yesterday or it's around your wedding. I'm not exactly sure when Kate's gonna send this to you, but happy wedding. Uh, so stoked for you both. Um, Frazier, I haven't got the chance to meet you yet, but I am sure that you're just a uh, loving and kind and good man. Uh, those are the kind of people that I know Robin gravitate towards. Um, Bobby, you're so great uh, and you're just, yeah, you're dope. And I've known you for like 12 years now um, and it's been great working with you. It's been great going to school with you. It's been great living with you. It's been great living in your house in Huntington Beach with your parents for those couple months. That was really cool. Uh, that was so nice of them to take me in. And um, I gotta say, out of all the people that I'm missing, I was gonna miss them uh, the most. Next to you, of course. Um, but I was gonna miss the Paganellis the most. So don't tell Katie, even though I think she's editing this video. Um, but just so happy for you. Uh, and so happy for your future and yeah I just really wanted to say I'm stoked for you so I got this uh, glass of wine and even though it is 9 30 in the morning um, I wanted to say a little toast so cheers to the happy couple uh, or as they say in Thailand Ming Yang Ting Yang Ti Mi Kwan Su I think that's right so cheers guys have a great wedding Mmm. Robin and Fraser, congrats on getting married. I'm heartbroken that I'm not there with you guys in person, but I hope that this video message suffices. Um, I love you guys so much, and obviously, if I could be there booging with you on the dance floor, I would be. But instead, I'm in Salt Lake City and it's snowing outside and my family left all this wine for me to drink they all left town today so i'm gonna have a good time in honor of the two of you and yeah i my mom was asking me how robin and i had met each other and so lauren and i were stuck in from which was the terrible girl dorm and danny susan kate and robin were in Hayes healy and thank God, Danny and I had met my first day of college, and Lauren and I had some friends in from. I didn't connect with them. I didn't love them. They were fine. But uh, through Danny, he connected me to Robin and Kate and Susan. And I think the first time we all hung out was 
at a Rubik's Cube party in some hotel in downtown San Francisco for somebody's birthday. And it was wild and debaucherous and hilarious. And um, I remember Lauren bringing like a sprinkle cake onto Muni and people taking photos of us because they thought we looked crazy, which is impressive in San Francisco to get that kind of acknowledgement. But anyways, I think that just kind of set the stage for our friendship and um, yeah, for all of the silly parties and outrageous things that ended up happening. Um, and was just thinking of some of my favorite memories and the places we've gone together, Robin, which uh, some of those are surfing or trying to surf with your Uncle Jamie in Huntington Beach and all of us getting destroyed by waves and deciding that we would rather not drown and just went and ate a ton of food instead or uh, study abroad and visiting you in London and seeing Wu-Tang Clan, which uh, is still probably one of the greatest concerts I've ever seen. Um, or even just like, I think one of my favorite things about you, Robin, is that you're always down for adventure, whether it's like having a picnic in Golden Gate Park or going dancing on a Tuesday night with fake IDs or whatever it was. Um, yeah, you just became so quickly one of my best friends and best friends for life. Um, and I miss you so dearly and love you so much. And I, when I think of you, you're definitely, Robin, one of the kindest people I've ever known. And when I met Fraser, I was like, oh, this is the other kindest person I've ever met. So I am just so excited that the two of you have each other. I couldn't be more excited about this marriage and that you're continuing your life with each other. I can't wait to see what that looks like. Um, I can't wait to come visit you and catch up and hear all the good details. Um, let's see. That is it from my notes that I took for this speech. But yeah, just love you guys. Sending you my best and cheers.